howling sandstorms. It rains every day here. I sure miss the desert. To say nothing of a good howling sandstorm, eh? Well, at least it don't get my armor all rusty. Let's go see what Tilda's up to. Well then, what's our next destination, kiddo? A nice hot desert, I hope. We'll know soon enough. Hold on. There. This is the latest fragment I picked up. The one from the Mayan pyramid. The fourth of the seven crystals of the magical Sharaman. Now we'll find out where our path lies. Once again, the enchantment has worked. Zenim's astral map is pointing out our road. Now it's up to you to decipher the signals, Tilda. Quite. Oi, this is bloomin' unbelievable, it is. <gasps> huh? Something wrong, kiddo? You look pale. No, everything is perfectly in order. Then why do you look like you've seen a ghost? Well, do you know just where we have to go to pick up the fifth fragment? Just tell me it's not a, not a rain-drenched jungle. No, it's Ooh. good old England. Ah, uh, yeah, that little island where we picked you up. Well, it ain't exactly the desert, but I guess I can't complain. Your father will be very happy to see you again. Quite, as will I. Well, let's not lose any more time. We've got to get ready. I need only five minutes. Same goes here. Just hold on, fellows. I have to ring up Daddy. We'll make it quick. I will. Hello? Tilda, love. I just got back from his shift at the mine. And we're just about to leave Mexico and go to our next appointment to pick up the next fragment of the Sharaman, because you see... Because that no-good ego Khan had Farak trapped inside a pyramid. But you put paid to him, and now it's clear you're continuing your adventure. Have I got it right? Right, but what you don't know is where our next appointment is going to take us. And where's that? Well, let's just say it's a place you're very fond of. I always wondered how the heck you fold this tent up. You pull on this rope, is that it? No, don't! Uh, Actually, we're going nowhere else but... Oh! Tilda! Tilda! Lord, love a duck, what kind of jokes is she playing on me? First she keeps me in suspense, then she rings off. <laughs> ah, you ah. stinker! I say! Ben, set the telephone line up again immediately. The showman's been waiting for 7,000 years. What's another five minutes going to be? You mean? know we'll never get the line set up in time. We've got to get a move on. Farhot got away again, but the game is far from over. That little worm will soon realize who Echo Khan is, and he'll be destroyed. No. And that pig, Snarchkoff, has gone into hiding, thinking he can escape my clutches. I could not have stood this stupid Babylonian demon for ten more minutes, not even five. After all, everyone is deserving a little vacation time now and then. Ah, and where could I have found a better spot for relax -sizing? <laughs> I love this stink of bitumen carried on morning breeze, huh? Uh, light, sweet, crude, not of bad quality. It's worth wasting a little to take away stink of disgusting salt water and is keeping away the sharks. <laughs> Lower cage! What is more refreshing than morning dip? According to my calculations, we shall reach the coast of Cornwall in eight hours, 16 minutes, and... and let's just say that in a little while you'll be giving your father a nice big uh, hug. Oh, oh. Uh, 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 what's going on? Howling sandstorms, I knew it! Knew what? All that water back there rusted my joints! And oh, so... Dear. So nothing. We're in free fall. All my potions are wet. I can't do a thing. Why don't you wise guys come up with that? Hey, What's the big flap doodle now, boss? The flight got too boring? Most amusing. Now, if it isn't too much trouble, could you open up into a parachute and... Uh, hey, no! Stretch out and grab that plane! Ah, I get the idea. You want to hit your ride! Whatever it is, please get to it! No, wait a minute. That's the late afternoon Miami-Athens flight. We have to find one that's making for England. Tilda! 
Where do you think you are, in a major hub airport? I agree! This is not the right time to be picky! <gasps> Has the board come to a decision yet? Here we are! I knew it! The New York-London flight should be appearing just about there! That's really very nice, but we're running out of time. Yes, but our ride has shown up. Do your stuff, Shadow. I say, what a jolly well executed maneuver. We're on our way to England, and the flight is right on schedule. Watch this. We're developing a bit of drag, but the instrument huh? panel shows normal. Uh, just an air pocket, Jimmy. Ah, oh, this is the living. Never minding this unbearable, miserable stink pot. Ego con? Uh, what? No, certainly not. No. So, I am an unbearable stink pot, no, eh? No, I am meaning these insults about Farhat. Unbearable stink pot Farhat. <laughs> Spare me your sniveling, cowardly lies and open up your ears, snatch cop. Certainly, you miser. I mean, of course, beloved master. I want you to know that I put up with your desertion because I knew you'd be useful to me in any case. While I enjoy a nice relaxing oil bath, I want you to take care of a couple of little birdies. Huh? What little birdies? Yamijo told Kasamalyot. He's on the airplane in sky. But what is at the end of this? Well, well, what do I see in here? Huh? <sighs> Farhat! Now do exactly what I tell you to. <laughs> Beginning procedure transfer of controls. Hey, what's happening? Huh? The controls aren't responding anymore. Transfer of controls now completed. Everything is in my power. <laughs> you said the appointment with the next crystal is in England, but where exactly? In a truly fascinating place. Stonehenge. Ever heard of it? It's a prehistoric circle of huge rocks built by the Druids and used as an ah. astronomical observatory. And who knows what other secret magical practices? The fifth crystal will appear there in 73 hours, 16 minutes, and... <laughs> That's not much time. Think you're blowing <laughs> funny, do you? <laughs> you certainly have the well-known redhead's temper. <laughs> Howling sandstorms. I don't remember England being this arid. Oh. Well, no, England isn't arid at all. Well, do you see any running brooks and pleasant glades down there? I don't know about you guys, but I find this place very familiar looking. I'll get the coordinates. Good Lord, we're nearly back in Farhat's kingdom. The airplane uh -huh. must have taken a wrong turn somewhere. Welcome to the den of the wolfses, my little lambs. <laughs> huh? Look, <gasps> there is a small plane under the big one. And look at its logo. <gasps> Snarchkov, curses. I should have expected it. Shadow, let go of that plane. Coming, boss. Howling sandstorms, I can't get started. Do you see any other planes we can grab onto? Uh, neither height nor hair. Shadow, you'll yeah? have to help us again. Serve us with a smile. All right, we need to coast over that ridge and find a good place for an emergency landing. Welcome, young prince. Monster, come a little closer and I'll... But what happened to him? Of him, but he must have landed by now. Howling sandstorms, and we're just about to crash. Uh. Ah! 
I don't know where I can land. Those ruins down there. It looks like a castle. There should be a courtyard. Now that the earth is under my feet, life is a great deal more precious and sweet. Quite. But what's happened to Farhat? <laughs> Not too easy hitting an invisible target, is it, young prince? Did you notice anything? He's just playing cat and mouse with me. No, Shadow. The battle is just beginning. Howling sandstorm. This is a real fortress. Rock solid built to last for centuries. Ah, ah, ah. Well, maybe it's growing old. Who would have wanted to live here? This place is really inaccessible. Not only that, it's kind of out of the way. You're quite correct. This is the most inaccessible fortress in the Orient. It's the fortress of Al Hamut. Did you say Al Hamut? Quite. The home of Hassan, the leader of the fearsome sect known as the Assassins. You know, I don't think I much like the sound of that name. You got that right, Bubala. Hassan the Assassin was a bitter enemy of my master Zenim. Hassan was a powerful alchemist and invented some magic potions that no one since him has ever been able to duplicate. Why was he evil? And his fortress has stood here down through the centuries. Because no one has ever tried attacking it from the sky. What do you mean? Just look over ah. there. Ah. Ah. I am always enjoying target practice. <laughs> we can't just stay holed up in here. We have to go look for Farhat. But how? He's got us under siege, kiddo. Now, where could they have hidden? Ah, oh, there they are. His excellent target. You know, we could try to sneak out so he doesn't see us. Nah, we'd just be sitting ducks for Snatch Corp. And all my potions is ruined! Wait a minute, lads. Look what I found down here. <coughs> An authentic catapult. That's great, kiddo. Let's use it. Against a super modern jet? Are you daft? My latest weapons of mass destruction will certainly be doing excellent their jobs. <laughs> we could oh. at least try to oh. figure out how it works. <coughs> There is nothing like beginner's luck! <laughs> nothing! <laughs> Here is speaking your CEO. Activate immediately plan 36M! I hate this strange quiet con that's come up all of a sudden. Lead me to EgoCon and let me destroy him! was flying to the southwest when I fell, so he must have landed beyond those mountains. Let's go try to find him. Huh. Trouble is, we have to get all the way across this plane. I can stretch out to maximum, but... There's EgoCon on the lookout, I know, but we have no other choice. So, let's go. <laughs> 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 Look! <gasps> this is insane snow in the desert. And in this season, that's simply not possible. Well, here it is. Ah! Watch out, Ego Khan, or I'll... What do you think you're doing? I've had enough of these tricks. We're getting out of here. Stretch out to the mountains. Shadow! Shadow, answer me! Shadow, come back to me. Oh, I'm frozen solid. Are we at the North Pole? Not quite. Now let the heat of the Shariman warm you up and try again. Oh, being toasty like this, I could go to the North Pole for real. <laughs> take two of them and go. Oh, yippee! <laughs> the 
Ming's abilities poor here. He's <laughs> a demon. Shadow! Shadow! I'll try another way. Crystals of the Shariman! Come back to me! Come back! Oh. Uh, uh, uh. Here they are! Why am I glad to be out of that pea soup? Uh, 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 I have an idea. We can't see anything all around us, but hey, the fog doesn't go all the way up to the sky now, does it? <laughs> no way in the world! <laughs> now I'll drag far up! Uh, oh! Ah! Let's get out of here! What are you talking about? We can't go toward the mountains! Uh, hurry! We've got to go back! Uh, uh, we're surrounded! Come on, hurry! No, I have a better idea. Uh, the crystals will protect us. Uh, 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 ah! It worked. But now what? Howling sandstorms. Look what this is. The evil Hassan's alchemist laboratory. Fantastic. <laughs> This is a rarity, Crudelia stinkfootsia. Pigwort as mortalis, incredible. I've never seen so many wonders in such a little space. <gasps> it's Snatchkov again. You will regret it you were not destroyed by my jet. You would have suffered much less. Bad move. <laughs> Ali, do something. This is the stuff my old pal Dudley Nightshade used to use. <coughs> Howling sandstorms, they're inedible. Why? What do you mean? This is all stuff that's used for black <coughs> magic. They can't be taken that way. All right, then how? I don't know. No use hiding. My super acid is capacious of penetrating into the rocks even the most resistant. <coughs> <gasps> What are you doing? That thing is nothing but a mosquito, and you keep mosquitoes away with smoke. Of course. You don't eat Hassan's herbs, you inhale them. We got the smoke gig. <gasps> no, it's me who is spraying. Good work, Ali! Nothing to it. It will take more than this to putting fly in my ointment. Ah. Can't get through. An uncomfortable position, isn't it, Far Hot? You just wait. Careful! If you touch just one of those crystals that are protecting you, the water will inundate you. Yes, but as long as the crystals are in place, you can't touch me. Oh, that is unquestionably true, young prince. But I can wait with the patience of a saint while you must run. Yes, you have an appointment to pick up the fifth crystal of the magical Shariman. And if you miss that appointment, it will mean the beginning of my reign over the universe! <laughs> you were foolish to challenging me. I am adoring challenge. And I am no prisoner's taking. <laughs> I think Ali had better come up with a very powerful potion. Ali, hurry, please! I could boil up some oil, but I just have enough for a couple of batches of blintzes. <laughs> I found it! The strongest, most powerful fighting I've ever known. The nasty Nautilia Horribilia Terribilia. How does it work? And today, I feel extremely... I did say extremely... Very 
very, very extremely mean. <gasps> <gasps> mm -hmm. Get him! Annihilating him! <laughs> It's all wrapped up. Now let's go take care of our hat. <gasps> Ali, that's still really you, isn't it? You're not truly naughty, I hope. <laughs> I am whatever I need to be. <laughs> <laughs> Seen the last of me, Farhat! No, not yet. But once the Shariman is complete, the world will have seen the last of you! <laughs> <laughs> 